In the shadowed corridors of global defense, where the invisible battles of the electromagnetic spectrum increasingly dictate the outcomes of modern warfare, Italy has made a bold and calculated move. On July 21, 2025, the Italian Air Force, with a resolute pen stroke, signed a $300 million contract with L3 Harris Technologies to transform two Gulfstream G550 business jets into EA-37B Compass Call Airborne Electronic Attack Platforms, marking Italy as the first foreign operator of this formidable U.S.-developed system. This acquisition, part of a broader $680 million foreign military sale approved by the U.S. State Department, is not merely a transaction, but a clarion call signaling Italy's ambition to assert dominance in the unseen realms of electronic warfare. The deal, woven into Italy's Piattaforma Multimissione, multi-sensor and joint airborne multi-mission multi-sensor system programs, underscores a nation's resolve to fortify its strategic posture in a volatile Mediterranean theater where hybrid threats and geopolitical fault lines converge. The EA-37B, derived from the sleek and versatile Gulfstream G550, is no ordinary aircraft. Powered by twin Rolls-Royce BR700 710C4011 turbofan engines, each delivering 15,385 pounds of thrust, it stretches 29.4 meters with a wingspan of 28.5 meters, boasting a maximum takeoff weight of 44,452 kilograms, a range of 8,167 kilometers, and a service ceiling of 13,716 meters. Cruising at 767 miles per hour with a reduced crew of nine, enabled by automation and optimized interfaces, this platform is a marvel of engineering efficiency. Its airframe, structurally akin to Italy's G550-based conformal airborne early warning and signals intelligence variants, incorporates fuselage fairings and a bulbous tail, blending civilian-derived cost-effectiveness with military-grade resilience. The choice of the G550, capable of operating from shorter runways, ensures operational flexibility and access to a robust supply chain for upgrades and spares, a pragmatic nod to sustainability in an era of constrained defense budgets. At the heart of the EA-37B lies the Compass Call Electronic Attack System, a technological juggernaut designed to disrupt enemy command, control, communications, radars, and navigation systems from standoff distances. Equipped with network-centric collaborative targeting, system control and monitoring, radio frequency receivers, software-defined radios, counter-radar assemblies, and conformal array panels, the aircraft is a veritable fortress in the electromagnetic domain. Its AN-ARC-210 RT-2036 radios, KG-250 encryptors, KY-100 terminals, KIV-77 IFF mode 4-5 systems, and ANPYQ-10C simple key loaders ensure secure and seamless integration into joint operations. The system wide open reconfigurable dynamic architecture, potentially augmented by BAE Systems' small adaptive bank of electronic resources in the baseline 4 configuration, grants Italy the flexibility to integrate third-party software and adapt to emerging threats. This open architecture, a testament to foresight, positions the EA-37B as a platform not just for today, but for the evolving battle spaces of tomorrow, where cognitive electronic warfare, exemplified by tests with the Angry Kitten ECM pod, promises to redefine conflict. The acquisition is a cornerstone of Italy's 3.02 billion euros JAMS program, which envisions a fleet of 10 G550-based aircraft. The first tranche, valued at 1.2 billion euros, secured two fully mission-capable EA-37Bs and six green airframes, while a second $925 million phase will convert four additional airframes. Italy's prior investment in two G550 CAEW aircraft with ELW-2085 radars and two Saiga-Int configured JAMS platforms reflects a coherent strategy to build a versatile, multi-mission fleet. 
The National Armaments Directorate's 2023 approval of the EA-37B as the sole system meeting Italy's electronic attack needs underscores the platform's unmatched capabilities. BAE Systems' $12 million subcontract to supply racks, radomes, cables, and harnesses, coupled with airframe modifications at Gulfstream's Savannah facility and mission system integration at L3 Harris's Waco, Texas site, ensures a meticulous transformation process. Deliveries, slated to begin in 2027, one year after the U.S. Air Force's EA-37B achieves operational status, promised to elevate Italy's role in NATO's southern flank. The EA-37B's lineage traces back to the Compass Call program's origins as a re-host initiative, transitioning the capabilities of the aging EC-130H, veteran of conflicts in Iraq, Afghanistan, and Yugoslavia, to a modern platform. The G550-based EA-37B offers superior survivability, range, and system flexibility, complementing U.S. assets like the EA-18G Growler and F-16CM Seed platforms. For Italy, the aircraft enables suppression of enemy air defenses, counter C-5 ISRT missions, and operations in anti-access area denial environments integrating seamlessly with its F-35 and Eurofighter Typhoon fleets. Unlike Germany's Tornado ECR, the EA-37B offers unmatched endurance and upgrade potential, positioning Italy to outpace regional peers in electromagnetic warfare. Its ability to conduct real-time signal detection, jamming, data fusion, and communication disruption without kinetic engagement aligns with NATO's joint all-domain operations, reinforcing Italy's strategic weight in a region fraught with Russian hybrid threats and instability from Libya and the Sahel. This deal is not without broader implications. Italy's pioneering acquisition may catalyze interest among NATO allies like the UK or Australia, as the US Air Force itself expands its EA-37B fleet to 10 units, with five delivered by 2025. The absence of announced offset agreements hints at potential future collaboration in software, maintenance, and training, aligning with Italy's 7.8 billion euros aerospace innovation strategy. The EA-37B's modular design and Sabre's open architecture invite domestic contributions, fostering self-reliance and economic benefits. Yet, the true significance lies in Italy's strategic foresight. By securing the EA-37B, it not only bolsters its deterrence, but also positions itself as a linchpin in NATO's electromagnetic strategy, capable of projecting power across the Mediterranean and beyond. In a world where the invisible waves of the spectrum hold sway, Italy's investment is a defiant stand against the chaos of modern warfare, ensuring its voice and its silence resonates with unmatched authority.